is up everyone welcome back Trivex Silver here today we've got some special guys seating rounds results SBX kickback battle 2021 y'all told me I need to check it out because you all seem to like the video yesterday so hey why not uh if you're new to the channel I'm Trivex Silver this is the silver order we hit 1,000 subscribers thank you guys I hope that you all subscribe as well remember to smash the like button if you're wondering where to subscribe you can check the corner over over here uh, yeah, that's literally where you do it. I mean, here's a little notification. Yeah, right there. Uh, anyway, we're going to jump in, watch this. I'm excited. Uh, I've only seen the newest little battle, obviously you've seen yesterday, so I'm kind of intrigued. As many of y'all know, I really didn't really get into beatboxing until recently due to you all requesting that I needed to check it out, that I needed to watch these videos. And the first one that I ever gave into that I started watching was Codfish, and he was playing Fortnite, I believe. And that was my first ever beatboxing reaction video, and it just utterly amazed me. And we've been growing on that ever since. Uh, so thank you. I hope you all enjoy this video as well. And other than that, let's just jump in and do it. All right, here we go. Uh -huh. <laughs> Welcome to the official ranking of the seeding rounds of the SBX Kickback Battle 2021. Our esteemed judging panel have made their final decision, and the ranking of each participant's seeding round has been calculated from their results. So ladies and gentlemen, kick back and relax while we go from rank number 8 to number 1. Starting off ranked at number 8, eight and one versus each other. Yes, Dilla. Yes. <laughs> Scanning planet Earth. Found these two life forms, plants and animals. There's these advanced animals that call themselves humans. They have this unique art form called beatboxing. <laughs> and there's this unique beatboxer named Dilip, who just did the best intro at the SPX kickback battle. Yeah. Okay, so now I'll be performing the first ever track by Dilip Beatboxer back from 2015. Level Zen Groove. And that's time. Ranked at number seven. All right, so Red I didn't mind. hear much for that one, guys. I really Let's just go. didn't. I like the beginning mm -hmm. part a little bit. It's interesting. Can do it like oh, everyone. No, I didn't like it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
Do I can do it like everyone Do Do I can do it like everyone Do Do I can do it like everyone Do Can do it like everyone. Look at my eyes and look at me harder. Like everyone, I can do it like everyone. Number six, Alisi. All right, so we're going to pause right there for a second. Uh, on that one, I think he went slow in the beginning. I liked his fast pace, his beat. Very repetitive, though. Uh, definitely better than number eight. So I can see why he's number seven. He, he did good, though. I enjoyed it. I never wanna dance again His guilty feet have got no rhythm It's easy to pretend I know you're not alone Should've known better than to treat a friend Take the chances I've been given I never wanna dance again Dance again with you again i never want to dance again i never want to dance again his guilty feet have got no rhythm
heard him once. I think Time. someone told me he made that himself. Ranked that at number style. four, Dudes. I wonder if that's true. Did, did he actually make that song? It does impress me. And you say fall 
Fuck is this here? Fool, fool. Singing is all I hear. Fool, fool. All these beats are so easy. Fool, fool. It's not fire, it's sweetie. Fool, fool. But it's stuck in my mind. Fool, fool. Maybe it's one of a kind. Fool, fool. Now I get why it's sick. Fool, fool. It's because it's music. <laughs> Once upon a time there was Brazilian guy for mm for mm for whose beats were so different and I do know why for mm for mm for so much musicality that I could die for mm for mm for it's bringing up the energy to level high for mm for mm Queen, 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 Queen,
at number two, D-Lo. Hello, I'm D-Lo, and I hope you enjoy my set. Uh, we know about Get your back one by you kiss to me. Get your back one by you kiss to me. Get your back one by you kiss to me. I'ma cut your claims away and chop away your energy. Get your back one by you kiss to me. Get your back one by you kiss to me. I'ma cut your confidence and chop away your energy. <laughs> And chop away your and the and the and the and the enemies. I'm a chop your dreams away and leave you with the enemies. And now for the next number. Wild Bell like featuring going, Snake he? Hips and D-Lo. <laughs> you say that you want me is too late. It's too late to love. You say that you need me is too late. It's too late for you. Way 
too far from Oh, you wanted me to be transformed I was trying indeed, but didn't work Way too far from Way too far from 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 That's time. Uh. Thanks to all the participants and judges for your incredible work. Good luck in the battles. All right. So these are the seating rounds, obviously, guys. Let's jump over here. So I can understand why he got first seat because, like, style was very clean, nice. He went straight into the transition to a new style, the new beat. Uh... D'Lo obviously transitioned, but he just, he, he said that he's now featuring, <laughs> and he like went into a whole different style, which was cool, I like I like the enthusiasm, I like what he did, it was an awesome way of doing it, maybe that like in, interflicted with what the judges wanted to see, uh, to like a complete transition to a different style, like he did, he did it very smoothly, it was very nice, uh, and it was all one beat, one song, uh, I like it, uh, I have no problems, I... I liked first one, first place, second place, third place, fourth place, fifth place was kind of strange. Like I said, his style is completely different than I'm used to, but hey, he, he does great at what he does, man. Uh, very interested to see what the judges do when they verse each other. I want to know how villain's going to be because his style's so weird. It likes not like weird, but you like unique all in general. I'm I'm intrigued. I want to know what's going to happen. Uh, tell me what you all think. Who do you think is going to win in the end? Uh, remember to smash the like button, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you guys, as always, in the next one.